Good morning, ladies and gents. Today we're going to be hunting the long-nosed unicorn fish. Now, this fish is available, from my understanding, from 6 a.m. in-game, which it currently is, to 6 p.m. in-game. But it's only available on the uh, Bahari Coast, so let's go. Let's see if we can find it today. All right. You need glowworms for this fish. I don't know if I have anything equipped for this fish. I do. It's about to die, though. It's fine. We'll use it anyway. That's a quick cast, sorry. My, my mouse sometimes double clicks, and it did it again. There we go, that's way better. Third time's a charm. How you guys doing today? Look at this sunrise, man. So I want to make a video about all the things that have changed in Paleo. There's been a lot of things in this game that have completely changed since the first release of it, since the uh, first um, open beta video that I kind of made and I want to go through and find some old footage and just show you comparisons of like things that have changed things such as like Zeki's underground shop to even the sunrise like the background of this used to be a lot different even up there like it used to be like super cloudy and you can really see it see much a lot of the stuff in this game has changed so I want to do a video based on like some of the things that have changed in the game over these last couple of months, updates and things that have been made because I've I found now that a lot of new players are joining and they're looking at some of the older videos that I've made and they're seeing um, things that are different, like the quest is has changed or, which I won't be able to show you that because I've already done the quest, so I don't know what has exactly changed as far as that quest goes, but I think if I start getting a lot of comments on my older videos saying that, hey, this, this quest isn't what it used to be, I'll just have to mark it as being an old video. Um, so people don't get confused. But how are you guys doing today? I hope you're having a pretty wonderful day. Ah, they're starting off with the BS already, Paleo. Starting off with the chest. So I don't like getting chests in this game because uh, all it does is clog my inventory and I can't get rid of them. Let's see. I do apologize if there's any quiet moments in the game. I don't really have much to say, honestly. Um, I do know that another update's coming up very soon. Uh, I'm currently recording this on the 25th of February, which means there's currently, uh, or very soon there will be two days of Maji Market left. From what the developers said, they will be ending Maji Market on the 27th. So I wanted to definitely do uh, maybe one or two more hot pot videos before that ends. Um, a goal that I kind of had was to do a super long one, but I'm not I'm not sure if I'm able to do that goal. When I say super long, I want to do like a three hour long, just hot pot video. Um, no audio, no talking, just straight up hot pot um, for people to enjoy. Um, I got a couple comments of people who said they like sleep to the hot pot sounds and I'm like that's super interesting okay so I think I want to do like a three hour long just you know hot pot mini games to sleep to um, and see if people enjoy that I don't remember what this fish looks like. I, I think it looks kind of like a swordfish. I do remember when we first were hunting for this fish, it was me and Picazo, and it took us like close to an hour and a half or so to catch the regular version of this fish. So I can't even imagine what catching a star quality version of this fish is gonna take. I'm probably gonna be here for five days. We'll see. I mean like IRL days. 
I see they have flow trees over there going off in the distance. People run into them. I should probably use a tuning fork too for this. I didn't think about that until now. Let's pop a tuning fork. Let's go. Make sure we keep on glow worms. Ooh, she got a tuna. Unfortunately, I think she's too far away for me to get any kind of a uh, fishing bonus with her. Cactus Moray. Might be able to get my fishing skills to 45 today, we'll see. Come on, big fella. Okay, I think there's a couple more spots this way. Yeah, there's a couple of spots this way. Alright, let's go. Boom. Oh yeah, I see them. Don't know if anybody else is fishing. I think they are. So these spots may disappear half-cast. We'll see. probably brought more um, focus food too. It's okay though. I still stick to the old school ways of just making the potatoes. Mainly because I hate min-maxing games. I hate like figuring out all the like best ways of doing things. I really like to struggle when it comes to video games. I think people miss that now. Like people I like, just want things to come so easily. And I get it. Like you know sometimes people don't have time for that kind of stuff and sometimes I don't either. But I enjoy a good struggle every now and then. Um, I don't like when the game becomes unplayable, but I do like a good struggle every now and then in, in video games. Ooh, I reeled too early there. That might have been that might have been the fish I needed right there, man. That might have been a rainbow unicorn fish, and I just let him get away. That other spot is gone. There's three more over here. This is the most I've ever seen to, to the south, to be honest with you. Get a little sip of water. didn't catch you little buddy I was taking a sip of water so I only had like one hand to reel this in with got a little assistance too just now guess she was in range of me just now Focus food time. That's enough. I'm gonna fish one time and I'll eat another one. A little quick cast. Now, ideally, I would love to catch a rainbow unicorn fish in this spot because it's such a short reel. Look at how look at how short that reel is, dude. Their spots here. I'm gonna head back down the coast and see if I see anything else. I see a couple more popping up. Let me eat some uh, food really quick. Go ahead and eat that. There we go.
Ooh, I think I overshot there a little bit. It's okay, I, got, I still got the fishing bonus. Thank you, B-Man. Yeah, I overshot it. Gotta go again. Yeah, I overshot the, uh, the hole. to stand here just so I can get another fishing bonus off this guy, but I'm going to actually move on. There's a fishing spot back this way. Okay. Come on. I still got the bonus anyway. I think as long as he like initializes the cast beside me, then I still get the benefits, which is good. So you have roughly about 30 minutes, from my understanding, to catch this fish. Um, when the sun starts setting, the fish isn't catchable anymore, from my understanding. So we might use like 20, uh, maybe closer to 40, actually. 40 glowworms or so doing this, depending on how far we have to travel. Another spot's down here. I can see it. Like I, ideally, again, this is the spot right here I want to catch it in, because it's such a it's such a short reel. Like I don't have to go all the way over there, all the way over here. Like I can kind of stay straight here. And this will be day one. If we don't catch it today, we'll come back again tomorrow and try again. But this overall will be day one. Oh, I'll show you guys this too, because I know I have a, a, a lot of new players that watch my channel. If you come all the way down here to the south, there's a phoenix statue here. And this actually means something, by the way. Like, that actually means something. Like, there's, there's, there's a couple of them hidden in Bahari. I'll just say that. There's a couple of them hidden, hidden in Bahari, and they actually mean something. Uh, there's a whole video I've already done on it, so if you guys want to look that up, it's right there for you. No, it disappeared. I'm going to see if it still counts. I don't think it's gonna count. I think I, I think I like just missed it. I aimed where the hole was. Yeah, it didn't count. It's okay. I get that times four real quick. I like how you can tell an experienced player sometimes, like a person who knows the map. The way she did it at glide, that glide skip was pretty good. Instead of climbing the rock, she took a little bit of a shortcut and just, you know, took a little glide step to the, to the right there. Let's see. What can I get rid of? Anything that's not starred, I'll go ahead and get rid of. Because I don't want to catch anything that's not starred. Ooh, got it just in time. Somebody said in the uh, comments, too, that the fact that I haven't opened my wish containers was giving him anxiety. For, okay, I have to admit, I'm a collector. I love to get, like, big numbers of items in games and open them all at once. Because, you know, I can make a content video off of it. Like, even now, I don't know if you saw me do 101 Zeki coins. I am, I'll just say this, I'm a little over, if not definitely over, um, halfway to getting that number again, even with Zeki coins. Like... I just been stacking them up, man. I love stacking up the big numbers and just turn them all in at once. I did say with my next video I might do 200 Zeki coins. Or see what the max number of Zeki coins is I can stack at one time. Think about it this way. When I did Magic Market, um, I got nine, 99,999 tickets. And that was the max. That's like how many you can carry at one time. You can't carry any more than that.
Cactus Marais. Okay, there's a couple spots this way. So we're gonna go check those out. Spam jump here so we don't get reset. Some of these spots are pretty difficult to get into, to be honest. It used to be a lot worse. Some of them used to be like really far away and you would have to like glitch cast, which I'm not gonna show you guys. Crap, <laughs> which I'm not gonna show you guys. All right, so I think it's been about 15 minutes or so, so I might have 15 more minutes to try to catch this fist. We'll see. Ooh, that fish is fast. Holy crap. Come on, Moray. What are you doing to me? You're trying to embarrass me in front of YouTube right now. Calm down. Phoenix Flames. That's a good name. Yeah, see how that, that, how that, how that works? One step a little too close, and you're drowning. Sir. There we go. Hello, blue crab. Goodbye, blue crab. this way. Now when we did catch the rainbow unicorn fish, uh, me and Pikazo, we did catch it in the north area of the map. So we're going to hope we get lucky again here. anything I might just get level you know 45 and fishing which isn't a bad thing I'll take that too we reached a halfway mark now I'm sorry 44 if I did I, I can't remember if I said 44 or 45 might we might end up getting level 44 fishing We'll see. I think I might be a little too far. Oop, another fishing spot here. Sometimes a tuning fork really doesn't show any. And sometimes a tuning fork actually lasts longer than it says it's going to, which is great, you know? just broke. 
Yeah, crap. All right, so I'm going itemless here. I mean, I have the speed hook, but I'm gonna be honest, I don't like the speed hook. Um, I think that item lasted me roughly, what, 20 minutes or so? Or 15, not too bad. So if I'm gonna do another one of these, I need to buy at least another two more, uh, buy at least two more of those hooks from uh, Einar. So now we have the speed, which the speed I'm not a big fan of, to be honest. I don't like the speed. Okay. I think I only have maybe like 10 more minutes or so. Maybe even less than that. Before this fish becomes uncatchable for the, for the day. And I'll just have to call it, man. But we'll be back. We'll be back. Try this one more time. Mm. Yeah, I'm nervous with the speed boost against these against this fish. Um Spam jump, spam jump, spam jump, right there. I do wish I could eat while doing this. Ooh, I can. fishing spots here. Making sure none have spawned behind me. Ooh, come on, Cactus Murray, what are you doing? seeing any fishing spots this way. Oh, there's one. 
That one just popped up. There's another one that I just walked by. Okay, cool. There's a couple popping back up here. Alright, love to see it. Got a blue manta ray though. The key to this one is just to wait for it to get inside your bobber, dude. Don't try to chase it. Like I just did. It's okay though. That's a different fish. It's the first time we were actually seeing one of those. And that took us what almost the entire duration of this. But we find some, we lose some. That is okay. Plus, it's a ray I already have, so I'm not too worried about it. I caught one, I think, uh, a couple days ago, too. So, that is okay. I just really want this long nose, long nose unicorn fish. Just was I'm nervous about it with the speed boost. Because the speed boost might end up screwing me over a little bit. That's a was an umber carp, I think. I'm trying to remember the fish by the colors. All right, we got two people thrown in this way now. Okay, there's a fishing fight over here. Go over here really quick. Hopefully, I'll still get that party bonus from both of those casts, but I doubt it. We'll see. Dude, if I lose this fish, I just lose it. I, I really could care less. There we go. I do need to buy the other one, though. The speed booster is just not my favorite. One thing I did know, notice about, um, about these items, though, is that you could buy them and use them, and you could still sell them for whatever amount of gold it has listed for it. So even if I were to use it to where it's almost broken, I could still sell it. Alright, we might be able to get one, maybe two more fishing spots, and our, our excursion is going to be done for the day. There's one over here. I'm going to try to make my way over to it. Jump so we don't get, get lagged out here. Alright, let's see what we catch. This might be our last fishing spot of the day. I'm not seeing another one that's close by. This more ray we have. Say so yeah, let's at least catch him. Yep, that is the last one. It is now 6 p.m., which means that officially this fish cannot be caught anymore. Uh, that's unfortunate. So I'm gonna try one more. I'll try one more spot just to end the video out with something. Who knows? Maybe we'll get another blue spotted uh, ray. See if we can find one more somewhere. Plus, I kind of want to run to the um, run to a um, what you call it, a uh, bulletin board, so I can pour it back home. Okay, there's one here. So we'll fish in this one. 
and then we'll call the video, guys. Alright, just a little tuna action. The sun's starting to set. Alright guys, I'll see you guys next time. Until then, please like and subscribe. This has been day one of looking for this <sighs> long-nosed unicorn fish. It could be five days for all I know, guys, but hopefully we'll catch it next time. Peace.